Yes, a lot has been said in regards to Arsenal versus Manchester City. Remember, it's taking center stage at the Etihad Stadium this Sunday, kick of 6.30 p.m. Remember, these are now have now become perennial rivals. Now, remember, in the last 11 matches, Pep Guardiola has, uh, has beaten Arsenal 11 times. And last season, he beat them 3-0 at the Emirates 3-1 and at uh, the Etihad 4-2. And also in the FA Cup, uh, Pep Guardiola won by a margin of 1-0. Uh, getting the better of Mikel Arteta last season, but Mikel Arteta this season uh, managed to bundle out uh, Pep Guardiola in the co in the Community Shield and also beat him one 0 at the Emirates Stadium. Courtesy of that uh, deflection from Nathan Ake, deflecting Gabriel Martinelli shot in the last minute. But now they meet at the Etihad Stadium in what has been perceived as uh, the title decider by many fans. We'll be waiting to see how that pan out. Just to bring you to your update that. With a 3-2-4-1 formation, which comprises of Ederson, he's back after that injury sustained against Liverpool. Uh, Kyle Walker, despite shaking or uh, despite uh, sustaining a minor injury over the weekend in the international friendly against Belgium, he's back at the Manchester City Cup and is expected to start for that match. Nathan Ake, Ruben Diaz. Ruben Diaz, Rodri and Stones are expected to be in the midfield. Of course, Rodri currently the best six in the world with uh, Stones uh, expected to partner him in that uh, hybrid law of where he'll be drifting in the midfield when they are in position and dropping back in the back line when they don't have the ball. Uh, we expect Phil Ford and Kevin De Bruyne, Bernardo Silva and Jeremy Doku to start up front with the Yatalisman being Alan Haaland. Remember Kevin De Bruyne uh, did not feature in the Newcastle match because he had a strain injury and Pep Guardiola opted not to risk him because of the first beckoning matches in the EPL Champions League as well as the FA. So Alan Haaland is expected to the to poach goals for Manchester City. On the Arsenal side, they are expected to start Raya, Ben White, Saliba, as well as Gabriel Magalais and Zinchenko. Remember, Ben White has just signed a long-term contract with Arsenal. Martin Odegaard, Declan Rice and Kai Havertz are expected in mid feed. Uh, Bukayo Saka, Trossard and Martinelli are expected to strike. Remember, Bukayo Saka, uh, Bukayo Saka and Gabriel uh, withdrew from the uh, international duties due to uh, you know, presumably injuries, but the uh, Mikel Arteta is expected to give an update in the press conference on how the, whether they'll be fit to start uh, this match. So the atmosphere is very high. A renewed sense of optimism from both camps is very high as we wait to see how that will pan out. Kick off 6:30 p.m. Pep Guardiola versus Mikel Arteta, Arsenal versus Manchester City live from the Etihad Stadium. But before then, we'll have a cut and raise between Liverpool and Brighton. And should, and should Liverpool win that match, then uh, the pressure will be on Arsenal and Manchester City owing to the fact that the gap between the three teams is just only one and uh, goals uh, difference. So a lot is at stake and we'll be waiting to see how that will pan out. Uh, from here, uh, from our live news centre, my name is Kagonda Kelvin. We